today I am reviewing Hot Rocks by Nora Roberts. Now, where can I start? I have to say, being a Nora Roberts book, I was expecting this to be really good. And it was good. It was good. It just wasn't wow good. Um, I think this one, this is probably somewhere between a three and a four star. Um, I said it was good. I was invested in Lane Tavish and her um, story. I'm also intrigued. There is apparently, um, when she's writing underneath her um, other pen name, um, it goes on and you can, there's another book where it tells her the father's side of it. Um, which I would potentially be interested in reading as well. Um, but anyway, let's stick with this one. Okay, we have Lane Tavish. She's living in this kind of small town. She owns an antique shop and things. And then one day, um, this guy walks into her store and the past comes for her, uh, literally. Um, and... So basically, she she's escaping bad guys. She's trying to find out the truth um, about her father. She is trying to find out um, where the diamonds are. Got a yes from the title. Um, and to do all this, she is doing all this whilst also trying to protect the new identity that she created for herself um, in this little village and things and the, her whole little life, which is actually really cute. And she's got this, I love the dog, her dog. Um, he just seems so awesome, um, as dogs generally are. But um, that was a nice element to that as well. Um, she ends up teaming up with this uh, gorgeous stranger um, and they end up having kind of whirlwind romance in it all. Um, I don't want to give spoilers. See, reviewing is so hard when you don't want to give away too much. But basically, uh, what can I say about this? What can I say about this? Um, it was a good read. There were lots of elements that kept it going and, um, you know, kept you turning the pages to find out what was going to happen next and everything. It just wasn't um, particularly wow. It was fairly predictable. Um, so there was no real, you know, calculating or major twists happening. Um, it was good. It was good. The characters in general were well done. Um, I noticed there was a lot of, I went to see some of the other reviews for this and I noticed there were lots of comments about the relationship that she has with her father. Um, I personally, I get it. I get it and I think it was actually done okay it should have been maybe thrashed out a bit more maybe it will be in the other book from her father's point of view um but i don't think that particularly deserved um negative comments if you like i mean i get where they're coming from how she you know protects her father at, at all costs and things when you know he probably doesn't deserve it but if you actually look carefully at their relationship and things I mean there is a moment there is a moment where I do get why they made those negative comments and things but as a general um, I don't think that was a problem but um, other than that yeah it was good I mean if you like Nora Roberts um, this was okay I just I expected more from her in this book as a general but um, I guess I need to read more Nora Roberts books. Um, but yeah, it was it was an okay read. And if you do enjoy these kind of mysteries, then it is definitely worth reading because it was good. It was good, just not well. But um, 
I should also mention this was previously published as Remember When. So alternative title as well for this. Um, but anyway, check it out. Um, that's it for today. Thanks for watching. I hope you've enjoyed this review. Um, and I will see you next time. Bye.